Hey guys, welcome to part two of how to make a sick looking background. It's Taint here and uh let's begin where we left off. So where we left off we made the three D text and uh we put it into Adobe Photoshop and that's pretty much it. So um in this part we're just gonna pretty much add everything together. I don't know how long this will be but we'll see. So um once you've got that in you just wanna go control N and uh make that a custom. Put the width to twelve eighty pixels obviously and 720 and uh, 71 resolution RGB color 8 bit white and um, I'm just gonna name this to um tut so um, here you go so now what you wanna do is um, file open um, now with this I put everything that I use in this video into the description so you download that and uh, find where like the smoke effects and all this stuff find that and then I'm um, dumping in there so I'm um, download it first maybe just pause the video and do that but uh, everything will be in the description to download so just as one zip so now what you want to do is um go to GFX um, GFX pack action I don't go in there I've just got everything scattered by the way so you want to go down to um, PS textures so just go to this texture I don't know what it'll be called but just try and find it um, I don't know which one actually we'll just put in this one and uh, drag it into this now go down to layers and hit um, hit overlay actually no don't do that just just leave that as normal so there you go now I'm just gonna put this as background and um, now while you're on background hit layer style and then hit gradient overlay reverse uh, radial and put that about to about uh, 21 degrees one sec, hit OK, I just need to see it first. Go back into it. And then, um, hit color overlay. I'm gonna put this as a nice blue. And then put the opacity down to about 56. So it gives it kind of like a gradient effect. Looks pretty sick. So now what you wanna do is, um, put that above it and hit overlay. And then put the opacity down to 40 kind of gives it a nice little effect so now what you want to now what you can do is um chuck this in here and um now yeah just delete that now hit control o or open it and uh put in the smoke that should be in the description and uh smoke cloud And then I'm gonna hit control um just screen. So it kinda gives it a smoky look. Hit um open and put an optical flare. This optical flare will also be in the description. I'm not gonna say any more of that description crap because you know where it is. So um put this one in. And then like before hit screen kind of give us a nice little glimpse I'm gonna put this actually probably on the top of the T so that there's the start of it hit control O and we'll open another texture so PS textures and um... Hmm. which one should I use I haven't planned this out just so you know so I'm just going with the flow um, where is it need to find it put this in also guys it's just about mi mix matching I mean you can do do whatever you want what you feel comfortable with this is this this is this a basic tutorial you can expand from this and uh, make the opacity about a 30 whew, about 50 yeah, that's about good so um there's the base of it okay so now what you want to do I'm just going to get out of these because I hate having a bunch of tabs. So now what we're going to do is um, click on the text, so whatever layer it is. 